Hello everyone, I hope you are doing well and having a wonderful day. Today I am bringing you a very valuable one more video for how to enter the water. Okay. We have a different way to enter the water by on your safety. We are diving now. So if you are interested to dive, let's follow this my video. You will learn how to dive. First, one important part. Don't dive in the shallow area. You must dive at least 1.6 or 7 meters depth area. If you dive in shallow area, you might you will get big damage. You might hit your mouth, you might hit, bump your head. It will be serious damage on your spinal cord. Maybe you're in paralyzed or maybe you are in death. So guys, very careful. When you are diving, everywhere in swimming pool areas, they have a, the notice Signboards not allowed to dive in. So guys, when you are diving, make sure you dive on the right place and the right way. So guys, if you like my videos, please thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed my channel yet, please subscribe and support my channel. I am able to give you more information about swimming and give you more tips and clue to develop your swimming. Have a great watch. Stay with the end. So guys, here is the step number one, how to dive in the water. First, you need to let it to fail on the water and being comfortable in the water. So, keep your legs on the wall and knee level on your water and it will be closed. Don't open your legs more, it will be closed by smoothly and relax and nicely. And then, you take a breath by your mouth and just fail on the water, lift your hands, get it forward and let you flow. That's all. There we go. Fingertips enter the water and glide. That's all. There we go. So step number three, what is called the back start. You put in your one knee on the ground, set your knees and the other leg on the edge. You let your fingertips inside the edge. So let your feel that you are catching in the water and you're catching the edge by your finger nicely. And then spread your legs a little bit, be comfortable straight and your spine straight. Stem at your hands, go behind your ears, stay in position. When you start to push, spin your legs, push by this leg and the leg, push the both legs back and let it be both together and draw pointer on your back, similar position like arrow. And your hands should be enter forward in the front. You enter your fingertips in the water and go under the water, under the surface and let you glide as much as you can. Here we go. So 
you guys, this is step number four. By standing, dive as normal. We don't have a starting point, starting block, I mean. So we are still in the edge, same level of the ground, it's the level of the pool. So we stand on like, you can put one leg back, like if I start, that is start to run. Yeah? And the other step, you can keep your both legs together and dive it here. Answer. Make sure that when you are diving, like when the aeroplane starts to take off, you should be driving forward and landing by your hand. And think of, think of it together first by your hands and behind your ear, and you should be looking down on the water, not focusing your eyes up. Here we start with the, the legs back. Start, I mean. The first leg, your finger is on the edge and you feel that you are catching in the water, you will not much flip in the safe position and you push yourself, sprint, go take over up and landing by your hand and the left chest and the thighs and the leg. At the end you will get into the water. So guys, same diving with your legs both together. Don't let it be legs together, let it be open a little bit in the wider of your hips. Stand nice and smoothly and comfortable. And that time you don't take your hands off here. It's not comfortable to dive like this. So you let your hands feel like this. Relax. Okay? When you push yourself leg, swing your leg, bend and train and take over up and land in the same. Once you get in over and climb, move your arm, throw your arm and forward and let your hands go same as the same as position behind you before you enter the water. Not after the end of the water. That you have to make sure you dive and push your hands forward and go before into the water. Your hands there and make sure you lock it. Not the hands will be spread. So you'll be safe standing on the water by your hands still all the time. And to make sure your legs push back and let it be stick together. Toes point on in your back. Don't point your toes down in the water. Water. So let it be. Point on your back. The hands there, streamline position, legs there, streamline position, not toes back, toes there, together your legs. Here we go. Four back. One, two, three. 